my girls and welcome back to another video today it's a very important day because today's the day I get my lips done and my appointment's at 2 p.m. so I really have to show you guys the before um, this is how my lips look right now and you guys can notice that I have a lot of fine lines and I really want to get rid of these fine lines because I feel like once I have fillers in, it will just like make them very plump and filled and not cracked or dry. Um, it will also help me improve my um, discoloration that I have on my lips right now because in the corners, I feel like I have like gray corners and like a very pink center and I just feel like I want that evened out as well. Um, also, I feel like I need a very defined cupid's bow. Like, right now, it's just not there, honey. Like, we need it. Um, yeah, so those are the reasons I really wanted lip fillers. Um, today, I just can't wait to take you guys along. Um, I don't want to talk too much. I just want to show you guys how the procedure goes. I hope they'll allow me to take my camera inside. That's one of the reasons I'm concerned today. But I just can't wait. To feel my lips. Oh my god, that feels so funny. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna treat with an antibacterial wipe, okay? Okay. It's got a pretty strong alcohol scent to it. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Strong scent, okay? I'm gonna have you part your lips just a little bit like you're exhaling. We're gonna start at the top, okay? Mm -hmm. Alright, so you're gonna feel a little pinch here. Pressure. Sheesh. <laughs> Is that okay? Yeah. Little tear. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Now go ahead and part your lips again for me. Pressure smoothing towards the corners, okay? Okay. Getting this. There's no minimum or maximum number of times to do it. Okay. But if you feel a lump or a bump, that's what you'll do, okay? Massage it. Mm-hmm. Just massage it away. So just massage it away from the center. Okay. You ice it? You'll cover your ice pack. Never on bare skin. Yeah. All right. When this fizzles out and gets warm, it's time to take a break. You'll put it back in the freezer, let it freeze again, and then okay. when it's frozen, you can ice it again, okay? Okay, so do I ice it right now? Yep, yeah. I'm gonna give it to you to ice right now. So the first 72 hours are the most impactful, okay? Okay. So ice as much as you can the first 72 hours. After okay. that, it's optional, okay? Okay. You can definitely use this for the next 24 hours, but also beyond that, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Um, so you want okay. That's it? That is it. We are wow. finished. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. She was my doctor. Very helpful. <laughs> Very sweet. This is what I look like after the treatment. Um, you can see it is very red and it's very tight right now. And the swelling will go down. The swelling is a lot right now. The doctor says it usually takes a week or two for you to see your final result. I'll give you guys a follow up. So this is me two hours after my procedure and my lips look massive. I look like a brat stall. I was really, really scared. My lips were really bruised and tight. And then by the third day, they were still swollen, but I started applying makeup, which was still fine. And this is my before, as you can see. 
I have very thin lips and this is on the fifth day the swelling has gone down and I have full face of makeup hi girls I am back and today is officially the fifth day after my lip filler appointment and this is how my lips look why no one mentions that there is a downtime after getting lip fillers done especially for people who are sensitive to pain there are three four days once my duck lips went away um this is how they look and this is one ml and already had very thin lips i will definitely go back again on night after eight nine months to get another ml done um because i feel like i really want them more plump and I would really really recommend go for 0.5 or 1 ml and then take it from there and I hate the fact that I did it so late but I'm happy that I finally did it oh, that's so weird um, but yeah I'm I just love how my lips look especially when I do my makeup now the other thing I love is that uh, my lips are not cracking or chapping they do get dry but I would get so many fine lines and cracks and it was just dullness on my lip. And after the fillers, it's just not there. And it's just an amazing experience. So I'll see you girls again with another video. Hopefully not a filler video because this can easily become an obsession. But I will be back again with another video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.